Hey guys, what's up? It's Dave, and today is Wednesday. It's 10.45 in the in the evening, or at night, not the evening, and uh, I just want to have a little heart-to-heart, -heart, so that's why I want to have this video. And I haven't made any videos recently. Uh, oh man, where do I start? So I guess I'll start with the unemployment stuff. I've been looking for a job now for about two and a half weeks. I've had a lot of interviews, probably like a total of maybe five or six companies I've interviewed with. One of them I ended up interviewing like five times with like five different people. And it was gonna be almost, uh, it was gonna be remote the majority of the week and then you go into Austin once a week. And I was like, that's cool, I can do that. And I felt like it went really well, everything, uh, like just clicking with everybody. And then I reached out to follow up and they ended up going with somebody else, so. It sucked. I was like super disappointed for that morning when I found out about it. And then I remembered that uh, I'm a spiritual guy. And so like, I'm just like, oh, you know what? Things happen for a reason. I did my best. I interviewed my best. I thought it went really well. So if it didn't, if it didn't happen, then it didn't happen. So moving, I'm moving on to other, you know, other stuff. But tomorrow I have an interview and then next Wednesday I have another interview. So, you know, there, there's still, potentials out there it's just like once I have these interviews like how long before the job starts and stuff like that so there's just a lot of I don't know, there's a lot of waiting and I thought by now I would have something in the pipeline but yeah that's that's what's been going on uh I feel like every day is just like my job well and it should be my job is applying for jobs like all day and making connections with people on LinkedIn and reaching out to prior People that have reached out to me in the past about jobs when I was working somewhere else. So like I, I have, I saved all this. Like I have a little data database and notion of people to reach out to. So I've been following up with those people, uh, but it's just like networking all day, you know, <laughs> like trying to network at least. And uh, what else? What else has happened? Oh, I had I had an appointment today with the psychiatrist. Uh, so I'm totally going to be transparent with you guys, uh, because I feel like that's just the best way to, to connect with, with you guys. Uh, I've, I, I talked to psychiatrists about ADHD, so I've probably had it for, I don't know, probably since maybe even high school. Cause that's kind of when, if I'm looking back now, that's when I had issues with focus and getting bored with things and not following through on certain things. I did good. Like I did all right in high school. I made mostly B's. Uh, prior to that, I, did, I was like straight A student. And then like high school, maybe end of middle school, it just kind of dropped off. So I talked to a psychiatrist today on a tele, teledoc type thing. And they had me, afterwards, they had me fill out this questionnaire. And then they had Molly fill out a questionnaire because they wanted someone in the family. And so they were like, hey, how long have you been married? I'm like, it'll be 19 years this year. And so he was like, yeah, she, she should know you really well. So Molly filled it out, we sent it in, and I have a follow-up on Saturday. And we'll see what happens with that. But we talked about, <clears throat> excuse me, we talked about uh, ADHD related stuff. We also talked about like anxiety, uh, which I feel like I've been having a lot more lately, you know, given like, you know, not having a job and stuff like that. I've had it in the past though too. I've always been a little bit more high strung. Um, I know I don't, I don't appear so like on YouTube, but like when, uh, when things happen like i'm the one that's kind of like i don't show it a lot but like inside i hold it in a lot and then eventually like it kind of comes out and i feel like sometimes i have like these little mini i don't know mini panic attacks like not where i'm freaking out like i totally understand that something's going on and so i don't freak out but i'm like why is my chest tight what's going you know that type of thing but so yeah that happened uh that's a, a totally a good thing i need i think it's something I probably needed to do for at least the last few years. And now that I'm not working, I'm like, I, I need to do this. So that happened today, follow up on Saturday and we'll see what happens after that. If you know, if there's medications or lifestyle changes and stuff like that, I probably need to exercise more, which I haven't been. I, w I really wish I would have started that as soon as I had my last day of work, just because I would be two weeks, two and a half weeks in, but I just been like, you know, super stressed about looking for a job and stuff like that. And so like all day until like today, I think I finished around like four o'clock. I was just like, all right, cool. I've applied for like 30, 40, maybe 50 jobs. Like I just apply, apply, apply. And, and then 
save all the emails in case someone reaches out to me. And then if I know who posted the job, I will then connect with them on LinkedIn and reach out to them that way too. I even had this other idea today where I shot out my, uh, what do you call it? Microsoft Teams email that I have. So that way if people that are on Microsoft Teams, especially in, in my industry, in the banking world, everyone uses Microsoft stuff. So I'm like, if I could take one more hurdle, one more hurdle away and people could reach out to me on Microsoft Teams after like looking at my resume, like that's another like efficiency straight to me, let's talk type of thing. So I threw that out on LinkedIn today. I'm gonna to put it in my resume. Just all these little things that I'm trying to, you know, be more efficient at, trying to take hurdles away, uh, make things flow smoother. So, I mean, it's it's been cool. That regard has been cool because I've really, you know, been thinking about that. Uh, but that's where I'm at. That's where everything's at. So sorry there hasn't been a ton going on, but you know, like we we went to Fiesta, not Fiesta Tech, so we went to SeaWorld because uh, we already have passes there for the year and then so things that are they don't cost a lot of money is what we're doing uh disney immersion immersive experience was a gift so that was really cool shout out to the person that got that for us and then uh what else and then just hanging out with my, like swimming at my parents swimming back here in the backyard in the little pool that the kids have just stuff like that it's what we've been doing um it's been it's been a good summer it's just been a little stressful for me like i'd rather have the last two weeks off not really worrying about job stuff but it is what it is life happens and you just got to keep moving forward and doing doing what you can so anyways that's it that's my updates hopefully some other stuff starts moving pretty soon um as far as job and uh just you know kind of see what direction we go in i noticed the channel's been growing like we're up to 645 subs so thank you to the last few subscribers um, and to everyone that has subscribed in the past and watches these videos, um, hopefully you like you like this. I'm just trying to be totally transparent with the life update, let y'all know where I'm at. Uh, you know, if if any of this relates to you, hit me up in the comments. I would love to chat with you guys. I've chat chatted with some people in the past on prior videos, and it just it brings me happiness. It, make, it makes me happy. So. Hit me up in the comments and I thank you guys for watching and I hope everyone is doing well. If you're not working, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna get better. I'm in the same boat as you. We're gonna get through this. So anyways, y'all have a good rest of the week and I will see y'all in the next video. Good. Oh, Emma, do you wanna say goodbye? Bye. She's gonna do the hand thing, y'all. Bye.